it's time for another edition of Crassy Poppin Cooking and today I'm making ice creams uh, I think all the wafers come like pre-made and you just make a filling and put that on them so it should be oh it's got a piping bag oh this isn't going to be fun uh, different opening box but you get the usual bag inside, instructions there. It shows you some piping techniques, but we all know it's not going to end up like that. Inside, we've got open. Here's a regular plastic tray, that's silver packets this time, uh, only two. Red flavour, blue flavour, bigger piping bag. Now, it's not actually separated, but the way it's it's listed, on, shown on the uh, instructions, suggests that it would be separated. So we're not going to get anything close to uh, nice patterns. We've also got a bag of sprinkles, a spoon. Two little wafer cones, a wafer boat, and two strips of wafer. In the tray, we've got five holes, little ones, two big ones for making the flavours, and the water tray. Start by cutting the water tray. To this big deep water tray. Now, instructions. Step one, turn your box the right way, pink goes in there, white goes in there, um, doesn't actually say how many cups of water, I'm guessing it's one, and these bags are a lot harder to open, so pink powder, never guess what it smells like. It's totally not strawberry. Cup of water. Let's up it off so it's level. And tip. We get the spoon and have it mixed up a little bit. I hope those holes aren't used to anything, I've just knocked some water in them. And I've just knocked some of the wafers, that's no good. I don't have anything to clean up spillages. Ah well. Let's put these wafers over here, out of the way. And now I'm going to splash back everywhere, over there. My red sachet done. Next, we make some white. That bag, I was trying to rip it that way, it rips down. So, we nearly lost the white powder. One cup. Pour it in and get mixing. White powder, red powder, mixed. Um, 
And what's next? Piping bag. Don't know how I'm meant to do this. on the spoon already. Uh, I have nothing to stand it up with. Oh yeah, if you don't know already I've got a dog. Oh, drop the spoon. So, that's the white in. Now I'm going to get the pink in, try not to mix them up as much as possible. Oh god, it's all gone wrong. Seem to have um, mixed the wrong way. <laughs> oh well. Uh. So now I'll put the cones in here. That'll make them stand a bit easier. Got a boat. These are meant to split into three. Three equal pieces. They are seven centimeters long. each more or less little cubes do the other one the same whoops I've got lots of these little cubes um, I've got a boat I've got cones and we've got the fun of piping this actually tells you where to cut the pipe bag, at least. Let's have a cut that there. And force this icing down. And ow! Start by putting a little dab in each corner of this. That's what it says to do. Um, then you put a square on top. And repeat. Some sprinkles on top of this. Lovely. Next, I want to make a cone to try and use up some of this white. And there's, there's my cone. Get a generous topping of sprinkles. And <laughs> it fell over. Next, put some stuff in the boat. That one almost looks right.
bit of the sprinkles. Sweet boat. This stuff's going everywhere. I cannot use a piping bag. And that cone came out a bit better. It's got a nice mix of colour. A few sprinkles on it. Which are more good. Um, Lay up the last one of these. Wait for things. There we go. <laughs> now the, the taste test. <laughs> Wafers with no sprinkles. Yeah, doesn't really taste so much because the wafers are plain, the white powder is plain, and the pink one's strawberry, so it's slightly strawberry flavoured. Plain, plain ice cream wafer with sprinkles. It's like eating, uh, it's just pasty sugar. Um, mostly strawberry boat with lots of sprinkles. That one's actually quite nice because the wafer's got a bit of flavour to it. Um, the strawberry, can't really taste it. But yeah, the wafer's not bad. Ice cream cone. Same again, really. Um, nice wafer. Got a bit more strawberry in it. Got one left. But I've still got some um, some black powder from the the bento kit. So what we can make? There's black ice cream, which might be a bit sour. Oh, my phone's going crazy somewhere. So. Wow. Yep, yeah, that stuff's really, really sour. It's definitely um, the most easy kit to make, so far at least. Um, you've just got two trays. Uh, it's sort of about piping and presentation, I guess. But it's not the tastiest either. Uh, there's just not a lot to it. Um, but next time, I'm going to make one of these ones. So, hopefully you'll come back and watch that as well. Until next time.